so I'm starting the stream a bit late tonight. Not like I have a schedule. But... If you waited, and you had hope, I want to say something. Good choice! Or... Good choice! So yeah, welcome to the stream. I'm, I'm a little late tonight. I had some... Some stuff going on, some friend stuff that was nice. Um, kind of some belated birthday stuff, believe it or not. Because I didn't really do a whole lot for my birthday, so a couple of my of my friends decided to, to do a thing. And we just played duck game and ate pizza, as you do. Um, so that was that was good enough for me. Plug my controller in. I mean, my Game Boy Advance game console is now ready. Here we go! Fuck. I think I may have to re-do the controls on my Game Boy real quick. Nothing crazy, but... Okay. Last time I played this, I had, um, a bit of a nightmare scenario. Arabian Night. So we're gonna just start with this. We're gonna get this out of the way. I didn't finish this. But what have I done here? Hang on, these controls are weird. I think I... B... Hang on, B... A... Got it. Yep, there you go. I changed them for Zelda. Also, I made this really low for Zelda. Okay, so I just need the key on this level. Um... Anyway, welcome to the stream. Weather is nice. Hope you're doing okay. Hope you're feeling okay. I'm, uh, doing my best. And I'm here, and I have, um... Lemonade. That's... Yep. That's what I got. Alright. It's fucking Dancing Queen again. You know, I still haven't taken pictures of some of the stuff that people sent me for my birthday, like some of the stuff that people made for me. Or the, uh, duck buttons that Adult Swim sent me, of which I now have three. But... You know, that's, um... It's not really relevant at this moment, is it? Eventually. Vinny, did you do Zelda tier list already? No. Um, I didn't have a chance. I wasn't- I wasn't home, really, today. Um, until later. And I'm gonna do that before I stream Zelda next. Now, she says... That's what she says. Um, made a tier list for Zelda. And the amount of hate in his comments on Twitter was... Next level, astounding hate. Let's just say some of his choices weren't popular choices. But regardless, it was just, yeah, I mean, he was just blindsided by the amount of negativity over his tier list. Vinny, you missed something. Do I need to collect the gems again? No, I got them. All, all I need is the key. Um, a CD would be nice to get, but I'm not gonna force it. Good choice! I can't help but think of that fucking Wario and Luigi game I played. Whenever I think of good choice! There's the key. The hell? The hell? So is that a a B pipe?
I'm not really sure what to do over there. Vin, Otacon has information on Garfield. I heard it. It's pretty good. I'll play it at some point, but, um, I know that there are other more popular things that people would like me to play on the stream. Ah, I see. So, I need the bat to get the key. Where, where is that? Listen, okay, I know it's from the, the fart. I know people were saying it's from an Overwatch thing. But the original fart sound. Like, where does that original, yeah, the nerf this thing. That was in another vi video. That was someone who went to, like, fart, and it turned into, like, that sound. Donald Duck having a stroke? It's a royalty-free fart sound? I'm not gonna play it. Hang on. Donald Duck having a stroke. I'm not gonna play it. Not loud, at least. Okay, that's so much weirder. That's so much weirder when it's not just a disembodied gnome fart. Ooh. I I don't think I can play that gnome video anymore. It's been ruined. It's it's it was pure until then, until that moment. I'm going to need a new gnome video with different noise. It's the only way, man. So I have the key. And again, I don't have to collect gems, so that's good, but I don't really know what to do now. Um, do I have to go up, maybe? Let's go back this way. Finish the level that it would be so easy. I'm trying. Yeah, this is this is correct, I think. And I missed those gems the same way I did last time too. Look how Wario just shouts at me to hurry up. CD is at the end of the level? Okay. Uh... I watched some footage of Wario where Shake It. Sorry, Wario Land Shake It. I always say that. And, um, it looks beautiful. It's hand-drawn. It's really, really nice looking. I've never played the game. One day I may play it. It's not even a long game. It's like about the same length or shorter than this. So that's like e an easy stream for me. Um, so I may stream that at some point, because I like Wario. Well, I don't really like him. I like his games. He's kind of a fucking asshole, but anyway. Wario... Shake It. Wario Land Shake It. His voice is, is quite different. Charles is, um... Even just within a couple years, Charles is doing some different things. Oh, there's the, um... I think I have time to get that. Good choice!
Someone just said, hey, the stream's not working on YouTube. I'm gonna try it on my Xbox. Got bad news for you, mate. I actually did just get another email about my stream's not working on YouTube. I'd say maybe like once a month or two. Every... once every month or two. Oh, that's not the way to the... But yeah, once every month or so, someone will email me and say, Vinny, your YouTube stream does not work. Um, long time fan, been watching for like five years. Where's the YouTube stream? And I'm like, ah. Oh. Just tell them the truth. I'm like, hey, listen, if I could, I would. It's just another option. Vinny, your Mixer stream just went out. What happened? Um, oh. Yeah, Mixer. Shake Shack. What, what's the other one? It's Mixer, and then there's another one now. Hit by Smash.TV. Vinny, I was trying to watch your stream on Grinder, but I couldn't find it. What gives? Good choice! It's all day. I'm gonna be. I've been thinking about it all day. Oh, lava. Alright, well, let me get a refreshment. Like I said, I have lemonade, but I don't have it near me, so. I'm gonna get a refreshment. I'll be back. Hong, Hong Kong. I mean, hang on a minute. I went with the pineapple juice instead. Yeah, the famous pineapple juice that people have seen. The people were on drugs. So, uh, people... Oh. So, I got a couple emails about the time I was on facecam for the Sonic video. One was, Vinny, this is a longtime fan. Please never, ever go on camera again. Thank you. That was one. That's a real email. Desert, I showed you that one, right? I showed the mods that one. That one was funny. Um, I like that one. And, uh, what was the other one? Oh, the other one was, Vinny, why do you drink the pineapple juice? What are you trying to do? And then they linked me to an article that says pineapple juice has some, um, interesting effects on... I just, I think it tastes nice. I like it. It's, it was just a convenient, nice-tasting juice drink, and that's really, there's all, not, that's all there is to it. And you should stop that. You... What is this? How do I get in there? I want to get in there. Vinny, you posted cringe. You're going to lose subscribers. Black Mirror season three soon. I was really, uh, I was really into the first couple seasons. New. Oh wait, what season? Are we on season four? Maybe five? God, I don't even know what season we're on. Jesus, it's only three episodes though. Someone just wrote, phone's bad. <laughs> That's it. The, the show does nothing else. It has no value whatsoever because it, it, there may be an episode that jokes about how phones could, could be bad, yeah. 
That's it. Reduced to its bare essentials. But, um... Yeah, there's an episode where the Prime Minister of England fucks a pig. But at, that's, um... I don't know if that's related to, uh, technology bad. Yeah, it is, actually, now that I think about it. If I remember the- if I recall the episode properly, it is that, yeah. That's just the first episode of the show. But no, it's a good show. I mean, some episodes are gooder than others. Um, and there are some very heavy-handed ones, but... I challenge you to watch the new Twilight Zone series, and then pop on an episode of Black Mirror, and you'd be like, Oh, this is... not even close. But it's just a depressing show. Twilight Zone is just campy and, and sci-fi, and... Never in my life did I ever think a Twilight Zone episode would have the word Eat My Vagina in it, but... That's what Twilight Zone is now, I think. Or it might have been Suck My Vagina. Sorry, I don't- I don't want to mince words here. But there was a couple of things I liked. It wasn't all bad. I've- I've seen some of the Twilight Zone episodes, and there's- there's a couple that were kind of cool that almost retained the tone... ...of the old shows. The problem is, some of them go for so campy. Oh, this is cool. Some of them go for really, really, like, heavy camp, and it doesn't really translate very well to the sci-fi they're trying to do. And then some of the stuff is just poorly written, I feel. I don't know. I don't really know much about anything. That's just my thoughts. Rip door. I bungled a door? Uh shit. I only have one gem. Vinny, uh, I bungled a gem. Should I just restart? Let me see if I can just get to the end here. But, um... Yeah, no, Black Mirror has its hits, it has its misses as well. Uh... And I want to like the new Twilight Zone, because I, I really, you know, I remember every 4th of July I would watch the old one with my cousin, my, my family, and, uh, some of those episodes are ingrained in my mind forever. Club cousin. Remember, I never really hung out with that guy. The dude that invites me to the club with Ava Mendez. You know, there's a lot of misconceptions about that story, and I'm here to set the record straight. Yes, Ava Mendez and Madonna were at this club. No, they were not happy to be at that club, apparently. Um... And no, my club cousin and I were not close growing up. At all. Different cousin. I just have a lot of cousins. I'm Italian. But, the- the other misconception is that... ...that this club was actually trendy. Meanwhile, my cousin was like, bring girls. I want you to bring girls to the club, Vin. I'm like, I- I don't really know very many... ...girls... ...who- I'm sorry, what do you want me to do? Like, you must be scraping the bottom of the barrel if you want me... ...to bring girls to your club that has... ...thousand dollar bottles of champagne and Ava Mendez and Madonna. Mate... 
what are you talking about? Only bring hookahs to club. Someone just wrote, doesn't know many girls, drinks pineapple juice for enhancements. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Speaking of... Get out of here. I'm gonna start a rumor right now that pineapple juice makes you shoot laser loads. That's the rumor. We're starting it on the stream right now. Alright. Spread it as an urban legend. There's no truth to that whatsoever. There's no scientific evidence. But, if you want to shoot lasers... That's how you do it. Now let me play a gnome video for you. Okay, so I'm missing two. If anyone um, can somehow help me out a little bit, it would be uh, very appreciated. Someone said, Vinny, you play gnomes, but I got banned for doing that. The irony. How are you speaking if you're banned? Did Nightbot time you out for a link for five seconds? That's not what he means. You know- wait, 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 you know what he means? What does he mean? He played it on his stream. He got banned for playing gnomes on his stream? I mean, he's got no other messages in chat, so I don't know that information for a fact, but... If you could get banned for playing the gnome video, what... What is this world come to? That is how you start a rumor. Yep. That's true. The pineapple laser loads, that's definitely not anywhere near as enticing. Doesn't have as much, um, weight to it as this new rumor. The other gem piece is to the left of that fire pillar. Jump over the left, it's there. Okay. Gotta go over the top, like Sylvester Stallone. Adrian, I'm drinking pineapple juice! After this door? Wait, was Stallone even in that movie? Or is that... Patrick Swayze. Or am I thinking of Roadhouse? What the fuck? Oh, here it is. Okay, so that I needed. And now there's one more. Final gem is after it goes ice, it's in a door you walked past. No, I- I specifically asked where that was, that's good information. Oh, oh yes.
you have been furnished. That's right. The informations. Remember, I am like an insider, furnishing you with every informations you need. That's the actual quote. Oh boy. Okay. Okay. Ice. I would assume this door. Oh! Yep. Cool, okay. Yep, now I understand why there was a door suspended in the air. Yeah, this game is great. It's really good platforming. I think, um... It kind of feels unique, too. Even though there's been other Wario games and a million other platformers, it still kind of occupies its own space. And it feels pretty replayable. A million things to collect, lots of little secrets. That bastard. Doesn't afraid of anything, that's right. Want a million things to collect? That's Wario Land 3. Is it? Yeah, but Wario Land 3, you're invincible. Which is good because I need that, because Babby Mode. No CD, just missed the CD. God damn it. Oh well. Did I blind it? So, um... You know, there's a gun that you can purchase legally that shoots salt at bugs. So if you have, like, bugs... Um... You know, that maybe you have issues with spiders, or, uh, centipedes, or flies, or, or... Bumblebees! I have one. It, I got one recently, actually. And I haven't used it yet, uh, because I, I will never use it because I don't want to harm bugs, because I'm nice. But if a spider is crawling somewhere around me, or a centipede, let's, let's say I'll leave the spiders. I'll, I'll be nice to the spiders, because I like them. Um, because they take care of the centipedes for me, so I'm not gonna fuck with the spiders, but if a centipede shows up... I may have an issue with that. Salt your pasta water from afar. Ooh. That's a good use. One of my last, um, centipede experiences from last year was just as the weather was starting to get cold, so the winter kills the centipedes. But my, uh... 
I think some of you may remember this, but for those new to the stream, I have a horrible story for you. I was about to fall asleep. I'm in my bed. And I'm real tired. And I... I start to... I feel something kind of fuzzy moving on my arm. You know, I have my, my arm wrapped around the pillow, kind of. And, um... It, I thought it was just nothing. I thought it was like, oh, that's probably just like... It's like, oh, I'm probably sleeping. Probably dreaming. Like, I, go to, I put my hand on it, and I feel it. I'm like, oh, wait a minute. Is that like a fuzzy thing from the pillow? Is that... What is that? So... I get up real quick. And I'm like, what was that? It moved. It moved and I felt it. What was it? So I turned the light on. It was like the size of my thumb, or slightly bigger. Which, look at your own thumb if you want reference. Because you don't know what my thumb looks like. Unless you do, you fucking creep. But, um... Yeah, it was a centipede. It was a house centipede. And I just saw it crawling around on my bed. And I never found it again. It got away. It, it was fa Those things are fucking fast. So I got away. And from that night forward, I was checking every inch of my bedroom before I went to sleep. I still think about it sometimes. It's been months. The centipede is still thinking about you. Well, I think the centipede might be dead because winter came and went. And usually, you know, winter... ...is the natural enemy to the centipede. So that's, um, that's a horror story. That's not a regular old story, that's just a horror story that I wanted to tell you. Which is why I now have the salt gun that ejects salt at a high velocity in order to remove such things from your bedroom or and or your um, kitchen. Centipedes like moist. <laughs> they do, as jokey as that sounded, they, they do. That's why they, they kind of like crawl out of your shower drain. Which is why I now... This is gonna sound weird. You know how porn stars bleach their asshole? Well, I bleach my shower drains because I want the centipedes to die. Someone just said, okay, I'm done. Good night. See ya. So yeah, you gotta bleach- you gotta bleach your shower drain. Um, if you have house centipedes, it helps. It reduces the amount. Um, sticky traps help. Having an assault rifle that shoots, um, salt is also quite nice. an interesting take on, like, almost a, a Mario-esque ghost house or a, a murder house. Severing the centipede's immortality, that's correct. You need a katana for that. Yeah, murder house. You never heard of murder houses? When I was growing up, there was a murder house. We had a local murder house. Did you, like, did you ever have, chat, this is for all of you, a local legend of, like, a murder house? Somewhere in your area, you know, whatever it may be, wherever it may be, someone was killed there. It's either haunted or really creepy or abandoned. That kind of thing. First, it's over here. No, we have a local crack house, someone said in chat. Okay. 
Well, we had one, and the... The scary part was that there was supposedly... Um, a ghost in the woods. And, um... People were talking about this ghost, and you would pull up to it, and it would, um... It would illuminate. And then years later, people were like, Oh, it's just the way light is reflecting. But I told this story already. Cropsy's a whole different thing. Cropsy is fucked. There's the Seaview home. There's a lot of haunted stuff on Staten Island. We talk about this from time to time on the stream. Um, we even have a house full of real-life vampires. Could you believe it? One was a warlord during the Ottoman Empire. His name is Nandor. And he goes, um... We drank the blood of some people. But the people were on drugs. They called me Nandor the, the Relentless because I did not relent. Did you see that Tommy Wiseau posted a me brawler of himself in Smash? I did see that, yeah. Tommy Wiseau is an opportunist in the most pure sense of that word. Haha, <laughs> I am his Smash Brothers! He doesn't know what that is. But he's been on Twitch a couple times. I mean, he's played some video games. He played Dark Souls on this alien show. Alien, why?! So it's, it's not like he doesn't know... Like, he knows what video games are. It's just he's not... He's not really into them. Um, and when he played them, I, I want to say played with air quotes, he kind of just ran into walls and stuff. Then he gets zombied for the CD. Oh wow, good advice. Don't have rewind. But I am having a rotten day. I think that way leads to the switch. Wh where's, um... Where's the, the CD? Is it here? The CD is behind doors that unlock on the way out. The CD is on the zombie path but, path, but after you hit the switch... Japes. Turns out the oft-repeated jape about Tywin Lannister was false. He did not, in fact, shit gold. Uh, screenshots released or behind the scenes photos or weird distant photos of uh, the Picard show and they like they brought back the, the TNG uniforms but it's 20 years in the future or so 25 years um, Patrick Stewart looks very old It's my only real observation. It's nice that the uniforms are back 
And I think he's still gonna do a great job. It's just, goddamn. This fucking aging sucks. Someone just wrote, time is a cunt. Yeah, I feel that. But I, I still think with, with the right script, you know, it could be good. The right scripts, directors, get that Kurtzman guy as far away from the project as possible. Uniforms are not identical. The pips are down below the collar. They might be based off the future uniforms. Um, there's also the All Good Things com badge might be uh, used. No, no, they're, they're a little bit further into the future, yeah. I read about that, the speculation of when the uniforms are from. But they look, you know, it's just nice to see those style uniforms again in Star Trek. I, I kind of hate the Discovery uniforms. Land blue jumpsuits. Like, we could do so much better than that. Like, I liked when Captain Pike showed up and he was wearing the yellow, like, the gold Enterprise, um, colorful outfit. And then they're like, yeah, we're gonna put him in the blue jump jumpsuit. And I was like, God damn it. Jump shoot. Basketball thing that you could do. Mega Man is jump shoot game. Oh yeah, I guess it is. That door was closed last time. Oh wait, no it wasn't. This door was closed. Vinny, are you gonna continue Enter the Gungeon in the future? Yeah. 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 Gungeon's good. I did a lot. I got a really cheesy run last time, and I, um... Earned no sense of satisfaction. But I did most of the things I needed to do. I just haven't killed the rat and unlocked some other stuff. And I got everything. Are you going to stream Tetris 99 event? Uh, maybe. There's an event you can unlock a Game Boy skin. I'm not sure I'm going to be around tomorrow to stream, though. Vinny and Vinny Vine Sauce lied about the Tetris 99 return stream. I did, yes. At first, I, I thought I was going to return to Tet 99. I just. I guess I just didn't feel like getting aggravated. I like it. 
And if I'm available tomorrow to stream in some capacity, then maybe I'll, I'll boot it up. But, I don't know. Yeah, we'll, we'll see. I was hoping for more stuff in the game. And this $10 DLC they're doing is just like a single-player mode. Kinda weird. Bird? So, for those that are, you know, who have been to New York and have ridden the Staten Island Ferry, uh, you know that there's nothing to do here when you get here. So, Staten Island was sick of that happening, because people ride the ferry for free, and then just go straight back to the city. And so they figured, well, there, there could be money here. And what they tried to do for years was direct people to local sights and sounds, like some historical stuff, some, you know, the mall or whatever. Just a way for people who are tourists to spend money in Staten Island. And it never worked. So what they did instead was they had this idea to build a giant Ferris wheel like the London Eye. And that was supposed to attract the attention of people, so they would be like, Wow, look at that massive fucking wheel! But, um, that fell through. And also Staten Island residents were like, Fuck that wheel! Like, we've never been united in anything. But, we were united in fuck that wheel. So, um, and the taxpayers were not happy about it either. Anyway, the wheel just got shit-canned. But the other part of it was an outlet mall, called Empire Outlets. And apparently it opened, and they did a big ribbon-cutting ceremony two days ago. Now this is just at, like, right outside the Staten Island Ferry Terminal, so if you ever are a tourist here, there's now, like, premium outlet stores, H&M, and all that shit. Stuff that I have no interest in buying. But I went over there real quick, today, and it was fucking weird. By the way... By the way... This was what it looked like over there. It, it's not open. 20% of it's open. The rest of it is crusty. Look at that dark alley. You know what that is? That's fear. The one down there on the left, there's so many... Like, the construction of this thing is really weird. But, like, it's like there's lots of little tunnels and caves, and they, like, crisscross the stores in a way that there's just weird, like... like, um, corridors that are dark. Someone said this doesn't look like New York. No. Well, it's Staten Island, which is a little different. Then there was this. I heard this strange noise as I was walking up the stairs. Keep in mind, again, grand opening two days ago. And there were a lot of, like, just dead areas. A lot of, like, creepy dark areas. And, like, lots of construction. And this is what happened. Almost Godfather. Just a dude playing a theremin. Looks like he was in Zoolander. Kind of cool. Also kind of weird. And then the most fitting... Um, the most fitting part of all of this is... I want you to... Be aware of Staten Island. Welcome, everybody, to Empire Outlets in Staten Island. And there is Manhattan. Interested? Please, we need tourism, apparently. Please. It, it's a lovely place. I just need to earn one more coin. Let's go match the 
Just those, like, regular old Wario? That's an easy one. Who is this man? I don't remember the mouth. Was it the big smile or was it the teeth mouth? The small teeth. Big smile or it was the big tongue? There it is. I got my coin. Good choice. Um, I may as well just get Visor Man again, right? Save for Bigger Boy? I don't want to do that, though. Vinny, you're on the front page again? Why? What? I... Are you sure it's not based on your interests? I don't see myself on the front page, because I'm not interested in myself. Um... Oh, wow, that's disgusting, this, this boss. Okay, I think I get it. He says, as he still doesn't get it, clearly. Yeah, I have to dash into the bat, but... Easier said than done. Easier said than done. Donk. Wow! Shit. Treasure chest for sure. Okay, gotta get the hang of it. New phase. Good choice. One more. Come on. Come on. Don't. Don't take the treasure chest away from me. Not yet. Gotcha! All three chests, clutch!
Glad I don't have to do that one again. I really had a hard time with that. One more level and final boss finish the game tonight. That's the plan. Got another boss right here, actually. Just backloaded all the bosses into the last stream. the night. <laughs> Much like Sekiro, this game too has CBT. Apparently on hard mode, this boss is a nightmare. Again, my, I'm my own worst enemy. Oh, now we got fire! Losing them treasure chests for sure. God damn it, I keep yeeting in the wrong direction. What did you eat for dinner? Pizza. Vinny, how much pizza do you eat a week? I try not to eat too much, but lately it's been kind of crazy because I've been doing the uh, the my my own pizza reviews mentally. Just for a second. Kern time? What do you mean, Kern time? 
Time to gr oh, 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 grind for some kern. Well, I'm just gonna get two. This is like the essential RPG experience. Like, boiled down to its bare essentials. Can't defeat the boss, go grind for a bit. I think the boulder is looking at the cactus ladies. Bad choice! Again, I think I know how to do the boss fight now, kind of. It's annoying, but just a little extra help would be nice. much damage does it do? One damage. That was not worth my time. Two? It did two damage? Okay, still not- still not worth it. Yeah, two! Three! How did I get three that time? Some people actually, possibly ironically, possibly non-ironically, tell me that my crystal, my um, Eminem impression was in Eminem's new song. Like Vinny, why, why is your Blapkins meme in Eminem's new song? I'm like, uh, it's not mine. Oh, I must have hit that. One pixel. One pixel. boss.
Buy chests. So that means I, that means I have to do this boss fight again, right? even die properly. If you hit him with the very top of your hitbox during the dash attack, his balloon won't rise and you can get more hits in one cycle. Very top of your hitbox during the dash attack. don't want to grind. People are telling me which items to get. I don't feel like grinding. Hit the mouse, but don't make contact with the bear. Okay. Perfect yeet. Okay, okay, I see. I got three that time. I was just kidding. I knew what I was doing that whole time. Fight the plant again, too. I do, yes. Can I do that now? 
Or do I have to wait until whenever? Practice, right? Oh, I can't. I can't do it. I actually have to do it. You have to refight. Oh, we got a boss rush. Oh, my God. So this is timed from the beginning. This is not excellent. Actor Keanus Reeves would be very upset with me because of how unexcellent that was. It's so nimble, Mario. It's like a gymnast. God. Stop trying to hump the walls, Wario. Want me dead. Vinny, do you think Wario drinks pineapple juice? I think Wario is very virile. Waluigi's the one who's barren. That's not... I, why can't I climb onto that? Jump up from the bottom area? Then he just spring? Go up! Go up! Metal! You wouldn't jump! There we go, now we gotta jump. Wow, this is terrible. I'm not doing well. Do they give me enough time for this? You have lots of time. Super hard mode is three minutes. Shit. Like, 
everything you've learned must be applied now. You want me to go left? Well, like this way? Left is bad. Oh. I think there was some blinding. Let's see. What did I miss? Oh yeah, I hit some, like, severe tunnel vision there. Someone said you're doing like five blinds per second. That's a new record. Got it. Now I just have to figure out what the hell that thing is. That was a lot higher pitch than I thought it would be. Someone said, man, Vinny, if chat wasn't here. No, dude. Streaming makes you stupid. It really does. It, it, like, I would eventually get it. I might die once and then eventually get it, but... I mean, try it if you haven't. We got this. Just gotta go back to the beginning. Going to swim. And got it. Three minutes must be a fun time on that level. Going to swim. for the final boss. I'll be fine. One missing treasure chest. God damn it. 
Wait, can I get that still? Yes, if you die. Once you win, yes. Okay. I'll need to pause this for a second. I'm doing my, um, pre-game yoga. That's a really good incentive. Show the player a cat throughout the whole game. Never explain what it's for, and then have it abducted at the last second. That makes me want to fight the boss. Here we go. is selling you items. Well, all right, fair enough then. Time to spin. All right. Like not yeet hard enough? This thing looks like, um, the... Oh god, what's its name? From Final Fantasy VI. Ultros! Now that's a proper... That's a proper throw. Oh, good. I'M STILL WORTHY! What the fuck, man? I'm trying to hit myself. I keep grabbing it instead of hitting myself. <laughs> I just hit myself as good as I'm going to hit myself. What is this game mechanic? Don't jump. Oh, someone told me distinctly to jump. Oh, 
that took fucking forever. It's for the best. Just let it happen. Let it happen! That could, in and of itself, be a highlight of fail. Like, if someone does a top 10 fail moments in Wario for Vinesaw stream, that would be 1 through 10. All right there. Bruh, no, the chest. Apparently you can't get the chest until you defeat. I don't even know if that's true. And again, I don't always know what's true in chat. They're just names on an internet. Names on an internet. Stop the spin. Sometimes people are like, no, trust me, Vin, it's your old pal. Um, Clussy... Clussy Fuck 49. I'm like, oh, that's a cool name. No, I, I've, I've known Clussy Fuck for a long time. Good lad. Very fast this time. The precision required to get this thing to hit you in your own head is not actually that precise at all, but I got it now. These faces. didn't deserve this. Just stay away from that hammer. Fast! Oh, man. Sad that's gone. It's, it's kind of now just all at once, whatever. Free for all, have fun. Okay! And that is a really weird face. That's a Troll 2 face. That is definitely one of the masks from Troll 2. You can't fool me.
mental. Cool fucking boss fight. Shame I didn't get that last chest. Cat's alive. Cat can continue its life. Selling items just to barely squeak by, you know, paying for an apartment that you can't afford, really. And only to one person at that. Mario is the only... the only person interested in the cat's wares. I knew that old man was trouble. I knew it. A cameo from the animals from Super Metroid would be nice right about now. Or like Samus running in the opposite direction. It's a little too cheeky though. I guess Wario saved the animal. One. It was never a cat. It was a princess. I guess the cat doesn't need to sell items anymore. Thank you, Wario. Why would you kiss Wario? Wario kissed a cat. It was a cat girl. It appeared on his doorstep. I'm, I'm glad that Wario got a little... little thank you kiss. Good for him. Mario and Luigi are the always... are, are always the brothers that are getting that. Wario... You know, he's, he's heroic when it comes to a large sum of cash. Really? Lyrics? Pretty fucking sweet. I like this game a lot. This was a game that earned its reputation. I had uh, always heard about how good it was. And uh, playing through it, I can see it still holds up. It's a fun, kind of smart game, surprisingly, for Wario. Not that he had bad games, but... Yeah, it's dopey, weird, wacky, and it's, it's just a good game. Good music. Then you gotta YouTube the other endings. I'll YouTube them. Yeah, I don't feel like I need to go back and fight that boss. I don't really care. I'll just uh, check them out. Someone linked a video. Perfect. So, Wario will continue with Wario uh, Shake It, Wario Land Shake It, whatever it's called. Not anytime soon, but I think that will be a good Wario stream for the future. What about Master of Disguise? Well, I mean, you could easily say what about all the other Wario games too, but for now I'm gonna stick with Shake It and then uh, see where it goes from there. It'll be a while from now. I like to mix it up, you know, like do a Wario game every like four or five months, do a Zelda game every like, six months to a year. You know, you, you gotta rotate your Marios, Warios, Zeldies, and uh, Troids.
Do do. I don't know why, at this point in my life, I've acquired three duck buttons. But it's a, you know, it's a cool thing to, sh to show people. Like, hey, check out... <clears throat> ah! Like, hey, check out this duck game. By the way, I have three duck buttons. It's like a party trick. I guess I probably... No, I wouldn't have a duck as a pet. I feel like some people could do that. I couldn't do that. But I would visit a duck that someone else had as a pet. That would be my, my goal. Yeah, I don't need a duck shitting all over my apartment. As cute as they are. Alright, well, I don't need a duck shitting all over my, like, outside. <laughs> I'd still... It's not just the shit, too. It's the... The stuff leading to the shit. I'd forget to feed the duck. And it would, like, quack angrily at me. New cat? I'm happy that cat survived. Because that would be a really dark ending for a Nintendo game. Uncharacteristically so. David and Dan would probably write an ending like that. And then the cat is killed by Wario. What? Steaks, eat as much as you can. If you continue with this save data, every boss will be revived. Start over and try to get all 12 treasures. I got a steak ending. Weird game. Yeah, like, why does the game say State 2 saved? You know what I mean? Like, what kind of weird post-ending credit scene is that? Strange. I don't know what it means. Just a bunch of random weirdness, probably. Because it's Wario. Alright, so... We're gonna take a look at this, uh... Ending video. So they escape. Um, same thing. Princess again. This is a different princess. The fuck? Someone said hotter princess, but, but... He's into more mature princesses. Oh, okay, he's into the cougars. Remember, Wario's only 17 years old. <laughs> yes, I am a bit child, that's right. Why do you look so old, Wario? What do you know? Aunt Bertrude. I, what now? The wh what's this now? Vinny, show the kiss. Oh, okay. I like that it almost morphs into one of the other princesses. <laughs> it tricks you for a second, and then this. <laughs> And then there's one more. There's one more. That that looked like Aunt Bertrude. That was Aunt Bertrude, I think.
excuse me, what? What the fuck is this? Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. So this is weird. Um, all of these endings are weird. And I think we saw all of them, right? It's just those four. Here I was thinking that at the end of the game, Wario was going to have like a nice big house. And like he was going to have, you know, all his riches. He was going to save up and buy like a golden mansion or a shack or like an apartment building, Waluigi's apartment. Nope. It's either it's steak and kisses from no. Then you're thinking of Wario World, which I am. I did stream that, but I figured maybe there was some similarity here. Um, steak happens regardless, so that's good. Wario is always into that, I think, right? Well then, that is Wario Land 4. Good game, weird game, I enjoy. I would like to play Wario, when, uh, Wario game Shake It at some point, but not anytime soon. So I hope you enjoyed watching it. Uh, it's it's just something that I figured would be a fun stream for a little while. We are going to take a quick break. I'll be back with some Smash Brothers. We'll check out some levels, and we'll uh, I'll fight. See you then. <laughs>